track checking on mobile board. In today's world, the application of scientific knowledge for a practical purposes, especially in industry, advances in mobile technology and available with the solution to problem related to them. Machinery and devices has been developed for repairing mobile phone from technical knowledge. What is track checking? In this section, you are going to study about the track checking method, detecting and broken tracks and related problems and faults. Let us first understand the basic meaning associated with track checking. It is line checking used to check broken tracks on the green PCB. A printed circuit board mechanically supports an electrically connect electronic component using conductive track pads and other feature. Printed circuit board are used in all but the simplest electronic products like mobile phone. Alternatives to PCB include wire wrap and point to point construction. PCBs require the additional design effort to lay out the circuit but manufacturing and assembly can be automated. Now let us study how to check these tracks on PCB board of mobile phone. Before moving further let us have an understanding of circuits on PCB board. There are two types of circuit which are built on PCB one of which is open circuit in which if a track is broken then it is said that the track is open and another is short circuit in which if two parallel separate tracks touch each other due to some fault that is known as short circuited. The tracks are not visible as they are drawn inside the circuit boards. Most of these motherboards have 7 to 10 layers which have track lines and going from one and other for supply of voltage and signals. In circuit board of mobile phone, tablets or any other electronic device, these are tracks instead of wire through which current flow. Hence, we use the term track instead of wire or cables. In circuit board of mobile phone, tablets or any other electronic devices, there are track instead of wires through which current flows. Hence, we use the term track instead of wires or cables. Let us have a look on the method of check the track line is broken or damaged because of some fault occurred in internal part of mobile phone. For this purpose, if the line is broken, the part component which get voltage due to it not function and you will have to check whether it is getting current. If any part where voltage and current does not passes or not getting power supply, it means that part is faulty and there is need for replacing. You can see track in the image in front of you. With a multimeter, check this track by keeping it setting on. If you get a beep sound, then the track is ok and the other problem is somewhere else. If you are not able to hear sound, then the part is faulty. This indicate track has been broken. Resolve the problem by performing soldering procedure. Now, what are the tools and instruments used to detect track? Multimeter is a major instrument by which you can find connectivity between one point of the component to other. Let us study multimeter in detail. A multimeter is a device used for testing and to check reading of various components in a mobile phone. There are two types of multimeter available in the market. They are classified as digital multimeter and analog multimeter. Analog multimeter use a micrometer whose pointer move over a scale calibrated for all the different measurements that can be made. Digital multimeter display the measured value in numerals and may also display a bar of a length proportional to the quantity being measured. Different settings of a multimeter are DC volt setting, resistance setting and continuity. Let us start with DC volt setting. We use 2 volt setting to check the voltage of the things to be checked. In DC volt setting, the output voltage of various things like battery, battery connector, charging connector can be checked. It is indicated by the capital V and straight line with 3 dots below it. Another multimeter setting is resistance. Setting in which the resistance of various parts like resistor etc can be checked. We can also check resistance between two points if it is instructed to check in a service manual to check to get a particular reading while repairing a fault. A multimeter is an instrument used to check for AC or DC voltages, resistance and continuity of electrical components. 
This instrument will let you know to see the if there is voltage present on a circuit. Now let us study how to use multimeter for measuring components of mobile phone. To measure diode, first connect the red test that leads to milliampere jack and black leads to diode circuit symbol. Now set the range switch to diode position and connect the red test leads to anode of the diode and black test lead to cathode. The forward voltage drop in MV will be displayed on the screen or display. If the diode is reversed, figure 1 will be displayed. To measure resistance, somehow involve same process as said before, in which first connect the red probe to MA jack and black probe to resistance circuit symbol. Then set the range switch to desired OHM position. If the resistor to be measured is connected to a circuit, then turn off power and discharge all capacitor before measurement and connect probes to circuit being measured. At last, you can read resistance value on display of multimeter. What problem can occur if tracks are broken? As they track for various parts and function all the along circuit of mobile phone are fabricated on PCB board. They are made to supply voltage to various electronic components like speaker, ringer, vibrator, LCD, etc. If the line or track for supply to a particular part or components get broken, then the corresponding component will not work. This way you can detect fault by track checking. Thank you.